guys, how's it going? Uh, we're just going to be here doing a demo. Wyatt's going to show us how to do a uh, forced approach. If you want to take it away. Uh, alrighty guys, so here we go. We're going to simulate our engine failing on us here, so I'm going to pull the power back to idle. And uh, immediately guys, you want to go in, you're going to start following the ABCs. So first thing A is we're going to pitch for airspeed, which is our best glide speed. The 172 is 68 knots. As we're getting towards that, we're going to start thinking about what field we want to land in. So, I'm sure if you guys probably can't see it from there, but I just might move the camera for us right off my right, sorry, correct, my left wing tip. we got a nice long, mile long field out there. That's the one I'm going to be going to be heading towards. So, we got my 68 dialed in. we got a nice long field picked. Looks nice and smooth. And, uh, Next thing is a cause check, so so C, we're going to take a look at all the switches over here, everything looks pretty normal, mags are on both, we haven't popped any circuit breakers, down the center column, fuel's looking good, looks like we have oil temperature and pressure, that's all fine, we check maybe our mixture, fuel shut off valve, we can switch tanks if that's going to help us at all, doesn't really look like there's anything obvious wrong, so now, just for practicing purposes, with that, I'm going to go ahead and just do a bit of an engine clear. So, I'm just going to bring my power up just for a moment. We're going to make sure that it's that engine stays running and idling in, in good condition here in the cold temps. So, we got our cause check done. Next thing is we're going to go ahead and declare an emergency. So, I'm going to switch my radio frequency over to 121.5. It's Squawk 7700 in my transponder. And uh, we're going to go Mayday, 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 Cessna 172, Golf Echo Fox Kilo, Golf Echo Fox Kilo, Golf Echo Fox Kilo. Got a engine failure, approximately seven miles southwest of the town of Stony Plain. Two souls on board. Aircraft is white with red markers. Mayday, 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 Golf Echo Fox Kilo, Golf Echo Fox Kilo, Golf Echo Fox Kilo. My field's just coming around my nose there. And what I'm doing is a little bit of a, an S turn here, I'm trying to lose some altitude. Looks like I'm going to be a little bit high, so I'm just going to do some big turns. In the meantime, taking care of my engine, I'm going to go ahead and brief my passengers. So, Dennis, go ahead and take your glasses off for me and uh, any other sharp objects. I'm going to get you to go ahead and just pop your door open now. And... Uh, when we land in this field, I'm going to go ahead and open the door once the airplane's stopped and go ahead and evacuate and meet me behind the aircraft. Take the first aid kit with you, fire extinguisher if you need. Here we go, field's just off my left side now. I'm going to secure my engine, I'm going to kill the mixture. I am going to dump out some flap here now. Looking like I've definitely got my field made. Here we go. So I'm going to go ahead and kill my mixture, the fuel valve, the mags. I'll secure the electrics now that the uh, ops are out. So here we go, coming into your field. I can see, guys, I definitely have it made, so I'm just going to throw in a little slip here at the last minute. Down we go. As you see, we have lots of field to land in. We're going to go ahead and overshoot and bring the power up. Nice and easy. We're just going to pitch the nose up to the horizon. Now, guys, I really got to hold a bunch of forward pressure and a bunch of right rudder here so my nose doesn't pop up like this. I got full flaps in, so I don't want that to happen. And immediately, I'm going to go to flaps 20 and retrim the aircraft. So we're climbing away from our field. Everything's looking good. I'm going to lower my nose just a little bit more. I can just see the horizon again. And I'm going to go flaps 10. Our aircraft's accelerating nicely. We're back into climb configuration. We're up above 60 knots. We're about 500 feet off the ground. And we'll bring those flaps up and and retrim. So there you go, guys. Well hope done. That, I hope everyone enjoyed that. I hope I didn't miss anything too important. I, I think uh, we would have made it. I think I think we would have survived. There's a little bit of snow in that field, but I uh, I think we would have made it. So thanks for watching our videos, and we'll talk to you guys real soon.